What a segue. What a segue. X-Men 97 hits 4 million views in five days. That is the report. Um, it is looking like some of that is fake, but let's get into it. So X-Men 97 hit 4 million views in its first five days on Disney+. Plus. According to Disney, this marks the streamer's most watched season one premiere for a full-length animated series since Marvel's What If debuted in 2021, putting X-Men 97 ahead of shows including something and The Proud Family, Louder and Prouder. Um, X-Men, we know what X-Men 97 follows up. Um, but so here's the interesting thing. So 97% of Rotten Tomatoes, right? That's sure, fine. Uh, however, why are, they, why are they using bots to promote it then? Good question. If that's all legit, what, how, what, so what, what, what's going on with the bots? So Master of the TDS, give him a follow over on yep. Twitter. Yep, he's Tell awesome. him I sent you. Um, <laughs> He's been doing some really good work, actually. Look, so that the, does a does a does a, a tweet, and look at all the bots excited for the premiere of Marvel Animations X Men ninety seven on Disney Plus. Can't wait to see the new series unfold. T minus days until the two episode special. It's going to be epic. Sounds epic. Sounds awesome. Sounds awesome. Sounds like a blast. So pumped. Counting down. Looking forward to. Anticipating. Excited for. Looking forward to it's going to be epic. This is bots. Yeah, they've oh, yeah. been caught now bot farming. Yeah. Oh yeah. And, and what's what's great about the way um, Master does break these down is he's showing you that a lot of these are blue checks, paid for blue checks that are doing this, yeah. which is quite crazy. Actually, yeah. they do that because blue check marks. Um, the, the point of a blue check mark and the reason why the you know the likes of us on the panel probably have it is because it, you do get a wider exposure. Yeah, that's the reason why, right? It like it makes your tweets exposed to more people. It, it, it boosts you in the algorithm. So Disney's spending quite a lot of money on this. Yeah, it's not a small amount that they're bot farming out. Like, look at this crap. Doesn't make them buying tickets sound so crazy now, does it? Nope. Especially when see. all a when all a positive review costs fifty bucks. Well, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah fifty bucks over on uh, over on Rotten Tomatoes. Um, has anyone watched this? Because I've not watched it. I couldn't be bothered. I have not seen it yet. I'm gonna watch the first couple episodes that are out this week. But I've I've not seen. I've it. heard it's pretty good for the most part. Actually, for the first couple episodes, anyways. Yeah, I've heard the same. But, I, but did you hear that from a bot though? Yeah, yeah good question. No, no, Clownfish uh, reviewed it. Uh, and there are several other people that hit on it, and they're like, you know, it's, it's, no, Paul Chato liked it. Uh, I yes. think. and then uh, you had uh, the um, the ladies were talking about it last night, and they liked it for the most part. Now, I guess there was one thing that was kind of like alluding to a January sixth thing, but. Much like the whole gay ghost thing, some people saw it, some people didn't. So, right, right. Um, so I just want to say this for the record: if I could find a way to care less about this, I would. The hilarity of this is, is this is the second or third thing now they've been caught in a week on mucking around with. Because, correct or fill me in on this, Nick, because I saw your. A little bit of your guys' reporting on this, but didn't you guys bust them for removing a bunch of dislikes on the Acolyte trailer? Yeah, Coach did, uh, and, and he did a video on that, and I, I don't know what's going on with that, but yeah, it seems like the dislikes are going down. I don't know if if they're talking to YouTube people and being like, uh, these are like spam bot accounts disliking this. We need to remove them so the likes go away. I, I have no clue. Boy, look at the uh, projection uh, there, man. Wow. Because they probably got bots liking this stuff too, on top of it all. Which yeah, um, yeah, absolutely. They and, will. and did Disney absolutely. say they were leaving Twitter? <laughs> of course, no, no they yeah. they just left. They, yeah, they haven't really left anything. Yeah. But yeah, so I okay, get there's more. Look at it. Yeah. Look how many there is. Look how many check marks. I know. Well, my understanding culture is these bot farms aren't even really all that expensive, are they? Because a lot of them are from like smaller countries and other these a yeah. lot of these countries that run a lot of scams and stuff. And 
Yeah, yeah it was I mean, cheap. If you've ever if you've ever seen a bot farm table, which is bas- basically just an A-frame with like a thousands of phones, just like like on both sides of it, and they're all plugged in, so you can actually essentially. Uh, you know, send it out via AI, give them a smattering of different, you know, prompts and yeah, each like one, one of person doing it all. Yeah. Yeah. And they'll just bang mm-hmm. it out and it'll just go. <laughs> yeah. And it like looks like, I mean, it, it's, basically. it's not just confined. To Twitter good or I think it's bullshit because here's the story nobody's talking about. And I tried to mention uh, this morning in my, my little six minute daily. And I, I don't have a large, large enough segment to talk about it because you know, there were 17 stories this morning, but 4 million hits in five days is crap. This is an animated They're running. Like that's a big deal. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. What's, what's the difference yeah, between a not. hit and an actual full watch from start to finish anymore? We don't yeah. know. That's yeah. the problem. And, and, and they say hits, views uh you know but what's a view okay so scroll down a ways because he this is what's going to blow your mind right they, they're telling on themselves here all right so it, they use some very like like this 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 very nuanced language to say what they're saying they said according to disney this marks the streamers most watched season one premiere for a full length listen to how many caveats are in here full length animated asterisk, series asterisk, since asterisk. since marvel's what if debuted in 2021 yeah. now hang on so this puts this puts um, X Men ninety seven ahead of shows including Iwaju uh, and the Proud Family, Louder Prouder, which is garbage trash tastic. But it doesn't include Visions. I am Gruder's Utopia Plus. So what they're telling you is you, you ever heard of the Bad Batch? It's a Star yeah. Wars show. Uh, when was the when was the last final season of the Bad Batch out, Nick? Nick? No idea. Nick? Nick's dead. Nick's Did Nick away. die? Yeah, Nick's dead. <laughs> yeah. No Nick's, mind. Dead. Nick's dead. Nick. Nick's, Nick, Nick's dead. Dead, I like Nick? Oh, dead. I like Nick. Nick. R.I.P. Nick in the chat. Nick dead. He will be missed. Vampire got him. <laughs> anyway, the whole uh, thing. under a work email. Sorry, I I, I heard you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Bad Batch. Did that come yeah, out? Just... Uh, yeah, just recently came out. I mean, the the season's still going. Uh, so, and, so what does that tell you? Uh, uh, I mean, X Men ninety seven's outperforming Bad Batch. That's right, and it sucks. They're yeah. telling on themselves that if they're, after five days, an animated an animation, which I guarantee you had five million little kids knocking their heads on the television in the morning in ninety seven when they were watching. This I was thing. one of them. Yeah. Well, and and, that's the thing. Is, oh, go ahead. Just call go me. ahead. No, please. And that was one was, day of the week. I was going to say, like, I can only imagine the ratings on this had they put this on an actual network. Like, I think that they, this is something that the normies would have flocked to, but. Bearing it on Disney Plus, like people have lost the luster with the streaming services. They are turning away in droves. They don't yeah. care anymore. They don't have the money. Uh, and something like X Men, I think if they had dropped it on Fox or uh, actually on ABC, which is probably where, where, where it would have ended up as a big deal, I think it would have probably gotten pretty good ratings. But this, they're just basically lying about getting 4 million views on a show, clicks, let's mm-hmm. say, hits, whatever. Yeah. I don't even know if that's legit thing yeah, we uh, uh, is that, that both was... episodes together that's yeah. my other question yeah, oh shit it... and this is worse than oh man yeah and and if it's that's the best we... for a premiere videos with more views than that yeah yeah it's not good. i think it's not good it's really not good <laughs> yeah real bad real bad and i think the bottom thing is the most hilarious part of it all yeah Just master's doing caught, master's like, doing a Master's doing a great job, and, and Nate's right. Do check him out. Master's a friend, so please check out his Twitter and his channel. Yeah. Gothic Therapy. Well, there you go. Yeah. There you go. 